All right, everyone, open up your maps. This is the operation for today. We are a small Kassikan group deploying behind enemy lines in order to stop an assault going on in the city of Chernogorsk. Our objectives are as follows. Within each of the hangars on two different airstrips, there are a number of Archaeotech vehicles hidden. Ancient planes that vastly outstrip the aerial power of our vehicles today, as well as Valkyries and, in some cases, Chimeras. Now, this will be a night operation. There is a Lehman Rust division due north, along with a number of Bane Blades and other heavily powerful vehicles. However, their tracks and other such things have deteriorated due to a lack of repair. As such, a number of them have broken down, and rather than continue with just the forces that they have, the division has decided to stay put and try to fix what they can. Once we are spotted, they will send this division down to the airstrips to push us off of it and keep their planes and vehicles defended. We will be splitting into two teams. One team will go to the northern insertion point up here and start progressing down to the airstrip, planting demolition charges on the hangars to destroy the, air the vehicles themselves. Barring that, they will take out pilots to ensure that planes cannot be driven. The insertion point was chosen by me. Down to the south, there are two other objectives. Number one, there is of course the vehicles in the hangars, but there's also a Vox operator. Upon being spotted, we have about 30 minutes before reinforcements come. If the Vox operator is eliminated, we will be able to gain more time. As well, once this objective is completed and then these these hangars are destroyed, the, this group will move to the hidden vehicle here and move up to assist at the northern airstrip. The enemy knows that we are somewhere in the area and they will have patrols. In fact, each of these airstrips has a large number of people on it, making our job all the more difficult. In order to get there, we are going to take these drop pods these personal drop pods carry only one man, and as you can see, we only have five of them. We have five reinserts after everyone has died. Our equipment is as follows. One of us had the option of taking a sniper rifle from the sniper mod pack, as well as a number of other equipment. Each person is supposed to bring along an Akatran AA launcher to deal with any planes that launch, alongside a stub pistol or any other secondary weapon. Their main gun could be the hell gun, the sniper rifle, or a silenced auto gun. It is recommended that you take at least one silenced weapon or something that can kill quietly. For this operation, I took along the hell gun, the Akatran AA launcher, and a silenced stub pistol. In hindsight, I probably should have brought along an auto gun. And the reason I'm giving you this demonstration right now is because I completely forgot to record the opening that Witterman gave. This is one of Witterman's ops, and Witterman is amazing when it comes to setting up missions like this. This Spec Ops mission is amazingly fun. It is amazingly tense. We had a couple of rules going in. Number one was that it was a night mission. That's fine for us because, and I'll try not to blind everybody, we have night vision goggles. That comes standard with most Kazakhan outfits. As well, the AI is set to a lower alert status, meaning that we had a good distance that we could stand up and walk towards them. It was about 100 meters standing up, 50 meters crouching, and you can get right up to them if you are laid down. Now, this only mattered so long as we were using a particular type of talking, which is whispering. If we didn't whisper, we would probably be heard, and the enemy would spot us and come running towards us. This mission didn't exactly go to plan. I probably should have been a bit harder on Chase when it came to bringing Brass Knuckles. I understand that people want to do melee. Melee is very fun in Arma. It actually can be very entertaining. Brass Knuckles have no place in a stealth operation if you do not bring a main silenced gun. Had you brought an auto gun, that probably would have been fine. As it is, the stub pistol, while incredibly quiet, 
has very little armor piercing. It would ricochet off the helmets of an armored guard before you know it. As such, we could not engage armored patrols with just a sound stub pistol. So we made the best of it. And due to some heroics that I wasn't planning, but happened, we got through this operation. And I want to show you this because this is how you do a mission, even with everything going wrong, really well. Witterman and everybody else did their jobs amazingly. I wish I had footage of the others, but uh, I, I haven't asked them actually at the moment. They might have footage. I could probably splice together something for the whole operation. This mission, though, I think cemented me as a possible squad lead for future operations and showed how I can handle myself in that position. So I hope that you all enjoy it. It's going to be tense. There's going to be some silliness to it, of course, because Witterman did fuck with Chase. But enjoy it. I love stealth missions like these. I hope I get to do more of these in the future so they can get reinforcements from. Let's move up towards it. through a lot of open fields, so I need to keep your eyes out pretty heavily here. Yep. I'll be looking toward the southwest. Followed the tree line. Probably now that you mention it. Yeah, let's head uh, east and follow the tree line just to be on the safe side. Gotcha. Let's pick up the pace a little bit. Keep crouched, but sprint. So if we're lucky, South Team will be able to handle... Oh. Uh, I think you were talking on LR. No, that was not me. Oh. I think it must have been a mispress. Yeah, I don't know. We've... Trying to get close to the base, so keep your eye out. Yep. If we're lucky, patrols will be scarce. If not, then we're going to have a problem, because there's only two of us. source um direct south to the building yeah i saw that too i didn't see anything at it but let's get closer yeah vaguely i see so it's not really moving so might be a bush so let's just get a bit closer and so look right up to this tree here and then let's pull up binoculars and take a look
Uh, um. Not saying anything personally, yeah? Uh, nothing. It's just, uh, with the, um, I think it's a satellite. Um, I think that might be someplace for communications. Or a TV. But that's just what I'm mm. seeing. Might just be a, uh, running into the local population. Let's stick to the tree line, give it a wide berth. Gotcha. I'm, uh, lagging a bit behind. I'll slow it for you. Thanks. Yeah, I think it looks like a remnant. Yeah, in that case, let's just bypass it. Gotcha. Are you set to whisper? Yep. I just want to make sure. Heard myself through your speaker. I think it might be a speaker problem then. Well, as long as you're set to whisper, it should be no problem. Alright. This mountain ahead of us, running to the side, is the enemy base. And once we crest it, we should be able to get eyes on. So let's get over to it. Gotcha. Okay, we're coming up to the road. I'll go first, get to the tree line, then you you cover me, and then I'll do the same for you. Gotcha. Alright, go. Let's go. So command said that this was a battalion sized gentleman? Yeah. We're two men going up against it. We're castle and we have better armor, but uh, better armor doesn't matter for much when you've got a lot of guns firing on you, especially vehicles. Uh, they know what they're doing. The administratum is never wrong. No, it's just a reminder not to go and get yourself busted just because you want to take something out. With brass knuckles, perhaps? Yeah, don't try it out. <laughs> we'll just make sure that we get the job done. Then you can mess around if you want. Alright. We need to make sure we get a good number of debt blocks on things before we try anything else. So, I think... This is South Team 2, North Team, I'll copy. This is North Team, receiving? Operator and now uh, wish to uh, go down the mountain and blow up the areas as well as take him out. How are you? Are you still spotting? We're approaching the mountain on the north side of the compound. We'll be getting into spotting position soon. Oh, we're still spotting. Got it. Uh, we'll, um, send I by. might have misjudged the distance walking a little bit, but picked a location that we wouldn't get spotted from. Ah, uh, see. Well, I uh, will uh, do tell when you begin spotting and uh, want to get going. We'll uh, take care of things down here for you. Uh, like, we'll, we'll uh, do it one together. Roger, you guys will have about 30 minutes after the first detonation. Uh, probably once that starts, we'll begin our own detonations up here. Exactly, so once you take him out, we'll have enough time, I think, to get in there and start doing our own thing. Ah, uh, so you want us to first take him out and then you take him out. And you take your stuff out. 
Yeah, because you guys will be on the way up here. 40 plus 15, okay. Uh, yeah. 45 um, minutes time. That seems like plenty of time. It is, but I don't want to bank on it. That's why I'm trying to do this in a bit of a staggered initiative, because their whole thing is taking out that lower area, getting into the vehicle and coming up to assist us. I want them on the way up in case things go wrong. Gotcha. And with uh, two against the battalion, it's pretty likely. Right, and they've got a vehicle. So I don't think that vehicle is armed with anything that heavy at the very least. It might just be a simple Tauros, but it's faster. And having them assist by dealing with stuff at the southern end while we have them distracted at the north is a better idea if things go out. I'd have preferred to have one more man, but, uh, well, you know how it is. Yep. Uh, Techie's probably gonna get here at some point, but... If we're lucky, we'll finish the op before then. <laughs> Sorry, Techie. Tell that. We're going the wrong way. We need to divert south. I need to get used to this I more. Gonna... I think we're... Oh, I... I believe I see light source. I think I saw it through the trees. I see we it too. I see it too. Over. Yep. Okay, let's keep progressing forward. Let's not get too close. Once we get towards the edge of the tree line, we're going to go front. Gotcha. By the Emperor, I hate stealth missions. They can be pretty fun, if you know what you're doing. We should be alright. Yeah. I'm just used to steel raining it. Yeah. We'll do that another time. <laughs> uh, south team to north team, are you in spotting position yet? We have eyes on the base. We are coming up on it now. Oh, copy that. We're uh, coming down to Sultan. Go to prone. Now that's probably a good spot. Let's do it now just to be on the safe side. If they take out their guy, then uh, we'll have a lot more time to deal with things, but I don't want to spend too long. We only have about six hours in the op. At that point, it'll become daylight. We'll be spotted pretty easily. You heard something? Uh, I heard the uh, team speak uh, do something. Oh, might have been somebody joining in. Yeah. Or was it a user left your channel team speak? <laughs> See the uh, lights south southeast. Let's get up to the tree line nearby and then pull up binoculars, see what we can see through the tree line. Yep. Unfortunately, the primer doesn't have anything for stealth. Don't get spotted. I can't say my litanies. So 
Just pray to Alonius Pius. That'll do it. That'll do it. Oh, I don't like that at all. They just engaged. There, it's just general stealth music. Either that, or they got some really... You thought that drum ting was a uh, auto going off, didn't you? <laughs> okay, up to this tree here. We're gonna crouch and take a look through binoculars. All right. I'm gonna oh, hold right here and turn fuck. down the music. Seeing about 10 times on the airstrip at the moment already. No, nope. 12, 13, 14, 15, 18. Fuck. We have the Emperor on their side. Our side, not theirs. Please don't shoot me. You're fine. All right, our objectives are to take out the vehicles. We need to get in close. Let's start by moving towards the hangars, ignoring the main fields itself. You can probably see the riflemen and such like that on the map already. Ready to move in? Uh, copy. Uh, ready as all ever be. Alright, let's go prone and make it slow. This is north team to south team. We are beginning our full approach on the airfield. We have about the same. Good copy. Can they uh, see through the foliage? Quite possibly, that's why we're prone. We've got about a 20, 40 meter radius that they can spot us from. In other words, keep your distance from things. We want to make sure that we get the surprise on them. Yep. I'm just worried that uh, uh, some of them have night vision from their uh, chaos corruption. They might. That's why we're trying to keep to the foliage. Yep. There's a wall between us and the airfield as well. We can use that to provide us with some extra cover. I, I heard something. Towards the east? No. Right behind us. It was walking. And let's keep going forward and try to get away from it. Hear it again. Leave it, just keep going forward. Wooderman's doing a good job with the psychological warfare. Probably. Just keep focused on the objective. Right now. You know, these stealth missions are always tense, but just keep it under control. We got this. This out of perimeter looks to be barely guarded. We could probably hop the fence to the southeast of us and be all right. Wait, chain link fence, that's a good spot. Um, the amateur is moving towards the other side of the airfield, so we should be okay for now. Let's keep going forward. 
that for the others? For us. I'm giving you updates on what we're doing in case I get shot or something happens. Alright. I think that, uh, I think those footsteps were just Witterman trying to get a good shot of us. Probably. He might have wanted to get us uh, on the approach. Witterman fucking with you? I don't fear you! Are you good? Keep it under control. Yeah, keep it calm. You've got me with you. We have this. You and me both have enough demolitions to do this. We can get this job done, get out of here, and, you know, get some recaf back at base. We're getting close to the wall now. Keep your eyes out. There's a row between us and the wall. Uh, how far do you think we are uh, to the wall? In meters. About 40 meters, probably. Alright, then we're probably within range of sight, even when we are prone. Yeah, that's why I'm keeping us towards the non-lit-up section of the wall road here. There's a guard tower up ahead. You see it? Is there anything in it? No. We're clear on that front. There is a guard post that's lit up. I don't want to go towards it. We're going to head towards the more darkened section of the wall. Gotcha. Just crawl across the road. Nothing coming, so let's just take advantage of it. They're expecting reinforcements from this angle, so it's probably not well defended. Also gonna have to limit the chatter by the time we get to the wall. Yeah. And since they can hear us. Definitely. Once we get to the wall, I'll go over first. You keep an eye out. Wait five seconds. If you don't hear anything, jump the wall. Keep an eye out just on the off chance that there are mines. He said that there wouldn't be, but I don't trust it. Yeah, this one does. Wait, there's a gap in the wall we can use. We don't need to hop it. Due east. Should we ask their status? Not yet. We... If they need to report something, they'll let us know. Uh, we should probably say that we're at the base, though. Yeah, I'll do that now. North team to south team, we've reached the wall of the base. We're going to go in now. Good copy. We are uh, almost at the first objective. Good copy. Ch Chase, over here. There's a hole in the fence. Huh, the guard post is empty. Well, that's funny. <sighs> Alright. Alright, then we're probably still good when it comes to chatter and viewing. Since we're, what, more than 50 meters out? Hold, I think? hold, hold.
Fuck. North team to south team, be advised some of the planes are already starting to take off from our side. I'm not sure if anything happened on your end. We're going to keep an eye on things. He hasn't. Good copy. It's a probably good reason why we brought AA. Yeah. If one of the planes takes off, that's all right. Let's just take out the rest there in the hangar first. We want to make sure there's debt charges on those. Be careful. The hangars probably have maintenance crews. I think by the time that happens, they're going to see us, though. Probably, but let's just make sure that they spot us when we have an opportunity again to cover. Yeah. Should we do a wide berth with the uh, trees? Probably, yeah. Keep uh, radio contact a bit low now. We're starting to get really close. Hold up the tree. A lot of infantry on the south side of the compound. Nothing to the north, though. I think we'll be okay if we go towards the hangars directly. Copy that. Let's follow this road up. Keep prone, keep slow. There's going to be a building ahead of us. Keep an eye out. Copy. We're coming up to the edge of the tree line here. unoccupied. There is a light. If we avoid it, we should be okay. Stick to the left side. Operator is dead. Alarm time is tripled or doubled. Not sure. Alarm time is set to 45 minutes. We're approaching the we full building. Spotted. Take them out. Complete your objectives. Get this done. This Corchetti doesn't seem to be shooting us. That uh, be... if we are aware, we might be able to spot that. We have 30 minutes then. Let's get this done. Chase, pick up the pace. I feel as if we should have 
No, uh, I just feel as if we should have gone through the left side of the house instead of with the light. Uh, we're out of light. Yeah. All right, I've touched the tarmac. There's a squad to the left-hand side moving towards us. Let's move towards the tree line. Move fast across the road. Slow it up. I think they know where we are. Just keep it quiet. They're intercepting. Shift east then. They seem to be moving away from in the direction of southeast. Hold here for a bit then. How did they not see us on the road? Don't ask questions, just thank the Emperor. First objective is within 100 meters. Have they gone off? Uh, I do still see uh, bogies southwest. Uh, they have flashlights, but they appear to be moving southeast. Um, they're looking all around. Might be that alarm that happened at the south base then. Okay, let's move southeast a bit. Keep giving them a wide berth. Copy. Gonna try to match their movements a bit. Now keep us farther enough away from them that they won't spot us and we can keep eyes on them. Building is our first objective, I think. We have that hangar next to it. North team to south team, how's the objective over? We have placed several explosives and heading towards an Avenger on. Uh, uh, we have interdetonated, we've been spotted, but they don't know our location. Sorry, they don't know our location, we're heading to uh, neutralize an Avenger. Roger. Uh, you should probably tell them about the, uh, flashlights. I don't think that matters now, they've been spotted. Yeah, good point. Okay, yeah. Hangar's our objective. Let's go. Let's 
Let's pick up the pace. We're starting to run low on time. I'm lagging a bit behind. Uh, I'll slow up a bit. Gotcha. Alright, I'm back on you. Alright. You can see the hangar from here. I think you can too. The door should be on the side of it. We can use to access it. Yep. Is the one closest to us or the uh, other one? Let's go for the one closest to us. Voices. Cross the road. Door should be on the other side. a bit. Uh, I'm gonna remind you, I have no way of stealth weaponry aside from extremely close range, so if we are... This is why I have a stealth pistol. Yep. If we are spotted, um, it's likely I'm not gonna be able to do it quietly, that's for sure. At the very least, I don't think we're gonna be immediately spotted. Chase, plant the death charge, I'll cover you. How many? Just one, said on the Avenger. They are in. This is self Kondorf team, we're about to place our final explosive, what's your status? <laughs> Over. At the first plane now. Copy that. Should I attach? Plan two to be safe. I got extra. Plan how many? Two. Uh, two have been planted. I'm rigging. Have you attached them to your detonation device? Uh, they are now. Uh, Uh, I think it's time to get on out of here. They're, uh, they? um, yeah, they're set. Yeah, are they set to your, uh, firing device? Yep. Alright. Let's go. One pilot's also dead, so that's good on our front. Yeah. Oh, jeez. Fucking hell, that's beat off. Here, Alanius Pie. Thanking the Emperor, we didn't get spotted yet. And for that They're stuff. planting their final bomb, so I think it'll be okay. Okay. Should we ask their status? No, keep it quiet. We're gonna kinda do a little bit of a circle around this place. North team, this is uh, uh, South team. Um, we had to blow up our explosives, we are currently, SPL first killed, I'm currently solo alive on the 
that can be a fire. Roger, if you can get to your vehicle, get out of there. I think you've gotten all the objectives. Uh, negative, there's still two, ob uh, two objective markers um, active. Okay. Try to get them. If not, then uh, I guess take them out when they launch with AT. I'm surprised we're doing easier. Uh, negative, I see multiple cameras incoming. I think I will not make it. Camper, yeah, we with you then. If they don't move over here, we're all right. Oh, shoot. Sorry, I'm checking the head. Uh, to have been set. Right. Uh, Let's go up the left side, left side. the sound. Pro from here. Let's see if we can't avoid their sight. Um, are we only supposed to take out the two hangers, or? There's three hangers in total on this airfield we need to knock out. The three hangar groups. Oh dear. Two more uh, ahead of us, two more on the right hand side. We got this. Uh, I have something to say that I neglected to realize. Um, yes. It is not a firing device, it is an M152 RAMS, so I don't know what that'll do. Should still detonate. Let's just. We'll improvise if need be, we took out the pilots. Gotcha. Sorry for the overs. No worries. It's just give an eye man for the future. If need be, we'll improvise. If not, then, you know, everything worked out in the end. Were you able to attach it to it when you interacted with the bomb after you placed it? Yep. Then it should detonate just fine. Gotcha. It's not a dead man's switch, right? No, of course not. Okay. I'm just... Yeah, I'm just worried that it might not have the same range. I think it'll be fine. We'll head towards the last objective that'll put you within range, I think. Copy. I think the fact that we didn't get spotted back there is impressive. <laughs> the Emperor has luck to spare. We have a long way to go. Alright, crash it. Go around the building. Let's not go through that yard. Uh, what's our next objective, by chance? Row of hangers. Gotcha. We'll need to clear uh -huh. each one. 
seeing what happened last time, um, I think you should probably um, make sure to top up on your magazine. I already did. Okay. Um, it's the only thing. This thing has six shots. That's all I got. Yeah. I shot him in the legs, thinking I could knock him down and take him out, but that didn't work. Gotcha. Plane. Wanna get it? Pirate I don't know if that's our... That, that's a repaired one. Hmm. Uh, this is something north team. We're heading to the escape vehicle almost there. Uh, there was a gigantic explosion at the, uh, the airfield over. Get down. Roger, we've gotten two bombs planted on two different planes. We're moving to the next ones now. Let's move toward us. Stop it out. Thank you. I'm gonna fight you for squad lead. Thanks for the promotion, I guess. Lay down as we get close to the plane. I'm gonna check the body, make sure he's dead. Ground forces be advised, uh, signals starting to break through to the north base. You've got about 15 more minutes until the north base is aware of what's going on. Go Roger. Plant the charge. Go plant the charge. He's dead. Did you say... Plant the charge or don't? Plant it. Is that my last two? I'll get the next set then. Behind you. Hit him. I can't block. Yeah, that's the downside of those. We got them though, I don't think it hurt us because that was a chainsword, not a, you know, blade. Yeah, I see the patrol, they're moving on like nothing happened. Alright, both are set. Uh, I'm gonna need to... Yeah, get behind the wall there, start doing Medicaid. I'll cover you. Lightly dings my chest and leg. I'll be up in no time. Roger. I'm gonna radio command. Command. This is North Squad. We've planted bombs on three planes. How many are there over? Uh, North Squad, be advised there are at least as many planes as there are hangars. Roger. Alright. Doing a count. All right, we're going to need to set it up to one per bomb now. I think. Um, if we're How lucky, have? I have fourteen. Gotcha. I think you have. Uh... Yeah. So we've got three. There's about uh, eight. This is self team. Do we expect enemy presence outside of the objectives? Uh, negative. Currently, they're not expected outside of military bases. Once we get to the next hangars, they're a bit more fortified, so we gotta make this really carefully, alright? If we're lucky, that plane came from the other side. I don't know if there's any hangars on the other side of this base. I'm so proud to say that I punch the renegade in the face. Down. He's seeing us. He's doing the straight.
Good job. You wounded? Uh, no, I'm fine. Yeah, I'm gonna keep the chatter to uh, zero. Good idea. You killed him. No heart rate. Uh, North team, be advised. We're picking up chatter. It seems that the uh, airfield has noticed that patrols are going missing, or at least individuals, but they're not sure what's going on yet. Roger, we've taken out a couple of pilots and a few individuals. We'll try to keep it down. A firm, with the exception of pilots, recommended practicing avoidance as best as possible. A firm. They're moving away from us now. Uh, I do note it seems some of the pilots are getting security details now. It might be more difficult moving forward. A firm will try to set bombs on the planes instead. Go around, there's a light. We may need to go loud once we get start going through these hangars. There's too many of them. I don't trust it. Side the hangar. Get him. I'm gonna plant a bomb. We need to move. Uh, yeah. ground be advised. They've heard a shot fired. They're investigating now. Yeah, it's unfortunate. It's, oh. Unfortunately, it's at the plane. We're going to shift a bomb in and then move fast. They're proning. They're proning. Explosive set. We need to go. Here. Chase is down. Gotta complete the mission on my own. Can't confirm. Two more pilots are dead. Now's not the time to be wounded. I get killed from there. Ah, oh, we had the bombs on us. Shit. <laughs> no worries. This is what happens when only one of us brings a stubber. I didn't see their guy behind him. You guys can take drop pods. Uh, be advised, I'm pretty sure you need to pick up your old detonators to use all the explosive you've placed so far. Yeah, I know where my detonator is, and Chase died in the same spot I did. We should be able to get him. We're gonna drop on the on the east side of the base. I'm gonna radio to everybody else as well. Make sure to reset your stuff. I yeah, that one was that one was definitely my bad. Uh, yeah, I had a feeling that might happen with the uh, with that uh, <laughs> with the brass knuckles. Oh god. Yeah, at the very least, we've taken out two of them, or four of them, so they are down a good number of pilots. So that's the good yeah. news. Make sure to grab an Akatran, and make sure it's an AA. We might need it. Yep. Yeah, the, se the fact that the second pilot came in to investigate gave me a great opportunity to knock him out. Alright, 
I'm ready to go, you. North team, this is South team. Uh, we are already at the south uh, side of the airfield. Um, if you need support, let us know we can go in with the vehicle. We're going to be dropping in. If you want, we could drop in there. We need to get our detonators from our bodies. Uh, they're in one of the hangars. Roger, we're going for distraction on your mark. Roger. Okay, we're going to drop in on the east side. I'm going to mark it for us so that we can figure out just about where we're dropping. So we're going to drop... Uh, uh, yeah. Okay, it's marked on map. You see it? Uh, no, Aim for there. Mr. Where we are hearing st uh, starts of engines on the airfield. I think airplanes are start taking off. Roger, we're going to get going soon. Yep. Get in the drop pod, Chris. Chase, you know what I mean. Begin distraction, we're dropping. This is gonna be rough. Takes out the pilots and the planes, we're good. I've landed, Chase. You? Alright. Chase, you've landed, you can get out of the drop pod. I am due west of you. Let's move. South team, this is North team. We made the drop. Can you see the planes in the air? Uh, negative, there's one interceptor up in the air currently. Um, else is everything on the ground. Saw that, jeez. I can hear it. I just... Say again? Uh, one deceptor is in the air. We did not identify its position right now. It's flying around the airfield still. You guys are on 126, right? We're within short range. right now, yes. Okay, good. Roger. Alright. Got eyes on the interceptor, I'm gonna see what I can do about it. Alright, my missile decided to hit a building. Uh, if possible, complete the explosion task. We are running out of time. Roger, we're going for a detonators, we're gonna detonate the bombs we've already set. Yo, alternatively, right. once we run out of time, you could, we could, you could just get into Star Wars and we could run from the Legion of Tanks. I mean, we, we are fast. Dim Let's not risk it. it. Fuck. Yeah, we're getting more accurate. He did say... You guys had their fire, right? It, we're under fire, yeah. Uh, try to get those things... Uh, SPF, can you heal me over the ace menu? Yeah. 
On it. We're quickly bugging out. Oh shit! Roger! Oh sh Yeah, our airstrike coming in. Uh, go around. <laughs> yeah, it's directly in front of us now. You're batched. Alright, I, I think Chase loading. has the detonator. Reloading, reloading. <gasps> Fuck, I'm hit. What's the location? Jesus, I had a gr grazing thing shot to my head. Uh, we are in the far. Well, out of the cluster of hangars, we're in the north one. Yes, the hangars, north one. Oh, yeah. Ch uh, Chase, I'm wounded right now. Uh, the one that they're currently shooting at. Yeah, my legs hit too. I oofed. Oh shit, I'm in sh shit, the SPF is down. Oh fuck. See if you can't get out of there, draw them away for a little bit, we can handle this. I'm injured, I need to quickly bug out. I got your firing device. Do you have your bomb? There, there are bombs on me? Let me see here. I didn't grab any. I panicked a little bit. Also, there's the Akatran, right. Give me that. I'm trying to get the SPF back. Alright, uh, Roger. Dallas, did you pick mine up? Picked yours up. Alright, gotcha. I'm gonna give him, uh, what's called a, uh, kid and welcome. Please do. Uh, I think SPF is gone, uh, gone now. Oh fuck, yeah, I, I think the wrong time. He has lo uh, lo lost a large amount of water, I think I need to reset his heart, yeah. CPI is, yeah, not possible. Go ahead, we can hold him from here for, for now. Um, no, we need to finish before the tanks actually come. Right, in worst ca worst okay. Case we can reinsert. Charles, we need to go around oh, the corner, no, sprint, do not okay. stop. Something flashed just on that one way. Chase, <laughs> why'd you shut the door? <laughs> sorry, Callus. I said, go around the corner, don't shut the door! <laughs> the Honda's on! I think that is good. Maybe. Where's that uh, interceptor? I heard it. There it is. Okay. Let's get. We're gonna get clear, detonate what we've already set. Watch that night, we'll go. We'll go. Chase, you good? Chase is down. Fuck. Detonate. Roger. Detonated. Uh, negative on your first planted targets. You're still up. He grabbed the wrong detonation type, possibly. I might need you guys to come pick me up. Well, uh, watch out my way. Which hangar are you in? Next to the one that's detonated. Sorry, I've got some some people shooting at me. No, no, I'm under fire too. Uh, there's an open hangar. I'm going to the open hangar. Sorry about this chase. I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to get your... I think I'm uh, next to you. Give me that. Okay. Items. Wait. Uh, Carlos, are you outside of the, of the hangouts? Yes! I'm at the back of them! God damn it. I'm not sure if I have the uh, detonation set up right. I'm gonna get in yours. Hop in, hop in. I'm injured. I'm injured. I'm injured. Hop in. I'm just Go! I'm in! I'm in! No fuck's sake! I tried to get into the gunner and it didn't let me in. Yeah, because SPF is still there. He's still unconscious. Go around then. Go to the hangar. There's a hangar outside. There's an open hangar. I will still there, stay there and banish myself. Roger. Is there a plane in there? Negative. That might be the one they were repairing that we took out the pilot of. Fuck, I'm taking shots. Try to get into the hangar. I'm in. I'm wounded badly too. It's mostly bruising, but I took a pretty, pretty bad rune. Give me a second here. Is this be all dead in the back seat? Uh, no, or... he's just unconscious. Okay, can you get up? Uh, I think. 
ground team be advised supply pod is being dropped in between the six hangars. Roger that. Oh, he's lost a large amount of blood. We need to go. We need to go. You can close those hangar doors if you want. Yeah, we're moving. Yo, where's the supply drop? Between the hangars. Uh, I don't see anything in them, except maybe the ones that are closed still have stuff in them. Give me a second here. Stop here. I'm going to make a run for the next hangar. Alright, uh, reinserting now. Roger that, Chase. Uh, don't forget that the first objectives, uh, the first thing, um, the first planes are still up. Oh fuck, there's two Avengers in here! Two more pilots dead. You serious? Hey, Romans. I took a hit. I'm low on blood, but I think Chase can treat me, or maybe you can. I'm not sure. Yeah, I'll be all right. I'll just hit a little bit here. I set up a detonator. Let me get the other one. Uh, Chase, where are you? Uh, I am east. No, yeah, east of the um airbase. Uh, Roger, can you come to the most southern oh, um hangar? We got two bombs set up. We should probably actually get out of the hangar. Fuck, is that the interceptor? Yeah, that's the interceptor. I have one AT. Give me some cover here. Clear back blast. Are we taking shots from somewhere? Oh, that's your gun, isn't it? That's your silence gun. I'm done. Uh, be advised, I'm heading directly toward you guys. From your northeast, I believe. Yeah. Alright, unsure if I took out that uh, plane or not. I watch I see Chase. You could ask me off? Let's wait quickly for a second. Let's be unconscious. He's lost a lot of blood. But that plane didn't go down. Be advised, 15 minutes have passed. Hostile forces have reached the Grozanov Pass, so probably five minutes or less out. Get us up, up. Everybody else, get it. Everybody, get into this thing. We need to move now. Chase, hop in. Okay, do we want to explode the other things also? Or? There's one more closed hangar. I'm gonna drop out, go into it. Oh it's fuck. It's Getting out! Getting out! Getting out now! If anybody has AT, take it out! Never mind! Did I do that? Was that my Helgen that did that? Yeah, you did it. Then they the other vehicles. There's still something inside. Fuck off. There's still something in this one hangar inside. Uh, yeah, I see it. Getting out now. Just drive around a bit. I'll take care of it. Did you take care of it? Just be aware, Kallus, you're infantry All right. approaching you. Yeah, I got the detonator on it. Watch detonator. out, watching from left side, left side, approaching from left side. In front of Get the door now. Come on, brother. Now it's not the time for me to die. Go, I'm gonna detonate it.
Why not? <laughs> didn't go quite so good. I'm not sure if they're dead or not. I'm the only one that reads this killed. If either of you guys are still alive, my de my body still has the dead in there. I'm not sure if it went off. That's a no, it did not go off. On the bright side, I think we take out enough of them. Maybe we got everything down, at least pilot-wise. Oh, there's another Valkyrie. With the pilot. Okay. Yeah, let me, uh... I should have dead man switched that one. Oops. Oh, wait. I need to go into the loadout. Oh, boy. Perhaps instead of that, let's try one last suicidal run here. Oh, right, wrong backpack. Y'all got seriously bugging smack there. Chase was the only survivor. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, no kidding. <laughs> yeah, hell strike from uh, Valkyrie. Oh, it was a hell strike that hit us? Oh, fuck. Yeah. You guys didn't response. even touch the Valkyries. The only reason one of them was dead is because a plane hit it when he killed it on the runway. Oh, seriously? Damn. Um, yeah. So like Second one still had both its pilots alive, and uh, it took off and fucked off. Yeah, I I had a feeling. I saw the, uh, god damn it. Chase, uh, Chase, my, de my body has the last detonator for that one plane that we didn't detonate. If you can get to that and blow it, I think we'll be okay. Yep. Just as so, just so you know, all the planes in the beginning of the airfield are still up. Uh, yeah, I know. We can only go to one side without possibly getting spotted. The right side had, like, all the infantry. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's it's because uh, Chase's detonator, I think, I didn't work. I don't know if he set up properly or not. <laughs> he had uh, he had a wrong one, I think. Possibly, yeah. We took out the pilots though, so those ones I think aren't going to be banned. Does anybody remember um, what amount uh, we have left? I just detonated another. Uh, the ones, oh, the ones at the front of the airfield are still active. You guys do have one drop pod left. Yeah, I'm contemplating going down there and helping him out. Let me just see. I'm gonna try something out. Because at this point, I don't think we have we can. They're all up in the air, so. Oh, I think it was six or seven people. Oh, we did pretty good for having a lower number then. And uh, out of those six or seven, two of them hit the south objective, and everyone else. Were those the last ones? Yeah, that makes over? sense. Did you detonate the planes? Yeah. Um, I got one, and I think I got the other in a chain reaction. All that's left is the Valkyrie and the Sheikra that are still flying. All that's left is the Valkyrie and one plane. Sheikra is that triple A? Sheikra? No. Are they both up in the air? Is that, uh, oh, you know what? I have an idea. One second here. I'm gonna try something dumb. Uh, can you mark the last objectives on the map? They're flying overhead! Well, that makes it all the more good. Chase, I'm coming in to assist you. At this point, I don't really know what I could say. It wasn't exactly like I had a plan. Just hope for the best. Pray something worked. And see if I can't pull something out of my ass. For Christmas, can I have a supply pod? Oh, jeez. <laughs> hey firm, where would you like supply pod drops? 
second, give it a second, give it a second. Never mind, I see the demons have arrived. You have left. Okay. MG. This now should be over the airfield to my south. Wait, nope, what? Right above me. When everything goes wrong, you kind of just have to improvise. Sometimes you just kind of have to hope be. that maybe, Should just maybe, you'll get lucky. And you won't get Fair. lucky just once. Can confirm Strella hit going down. Only thing left is that. That's just a matter of escaping. I wish that I could say that I was being brave here. I wish I could say that I had some thought that maybe I could replicate what was going on in the airfield. I had honestly forgotten I had done it. I knew I was dead. Everything was firing on me. I had no chance. But I just prayed as much as I could that maybe, just maybe, I'd get lucky a second time. And then... I saw it. Valkyrie's also down. Getting out of here. You're a you're a rock star. You understand that, Callus? You're a rock star. I'm a rock star about to be shot. Uh, Callus, make it about 500 meters north, and we'll be able to exfil you. Roger. Oh. Fuck you, heretics! Us. Confirm, can't hear. Uh, make your way to the pickup marker north of you. Roger, I can't check right now, I'm still being shot at. Fucking hell. If I get down at the tree line here, I should be okay. Side isn't that great. Okay. Callus, we have two Valks in route to pick you up. You need to get to that LZ ASAP. I'm close to it. Or do we have a tail gunner? I have broken contact from the enemy. You guys are going to drop in. ETA tells he's about one mic. Roger. 
Just stay alive until then. I see you guys overhead. Fuck, leave it with us! Don't like the look at that bell, we're gonna need to take off fast. I am in! Go! 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 In the Valk! Take off! Now! Holy fucking shit! Uh oh. <sighs> I cannot fucking believe I made it out of that. Good fucking job, uh, 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 man. Wow. How do you do that? Tell, <laughs> tell your story. I brought four rockets with me. I realized that the plane was shaking them off on the first one, but it had a long cooldown on its countermeasure. So I hit it with the second one as it went past. <laughs> the Valk hey guys, took the two. Some AA. Man, so you, uh, so you brought a bunch of AA rockets? I did, that was all I brought, and the last Valk, the Valkyrie actually didn't take down with AA, I took it down with a Hellgun. Oh, fucking nice. <laughs> I, I just barraged the fucking thing until I knocked it out. Oh. <laughs> I better get a fucking promotion for that. <laughs> I got it all on stream too. Unscripted veteran. Oh, son of a bitch. <laughs> First time being squad lead. God damn it. Good squad lead. <laughs> oh. Oh, fuck. Yeah, I, I can't see much of my uh, user interface with the in the dark. It kind of sucks. I feel like it should be lit. You might be able to see it with night vision. You're almost to the ground. Uh, uh, not really. Ah, sucks. I can't. I'm not using it. It doesn't show it. All right, we're down. <sighs> uh, Waterman, can we get the uh, Arma mission complete? <laughs> Holy fucking shit. Shikra? Wait, Shikra? Coming at us? Yes, grab an AA launcher. Guys, AA now! AA now! Go for that. Oh, I apparently still had rockets. Uh, can I request uh, to command that we have a fight club at the end of the up? <laughs> First rule of Fight Club is you don't talk about fucking Fight Club. You should know this by now. You said it's from the West? <laughs> That's my boy. Just to check, it's coming from the West, right? They from West, almost directly. Alright, everybody stagger. Let's not get each other in the back blast. We're gonna be a human Hydra battery. You got it? I spot it! Went way overhead, way fast. Uh, just flew over us there. Oh, there it is. Uh, bearing southeast. Firing. <laughs> I see it now. Clear back blast. Firing. Clear back blast. Clear back blast. 
Hit it. There you go. You got it. It's going down. <laughs> yeah, you did. Oh, we timed those rockets perfectly on that last one. <laughs> Oh. Thank you for that. Did you asshole? <laughs> I don't think Chance was the one to hit you with that. God damn it. Don't forget we still have a woolen vest. Yeah. <laughs> The tanks were there. I just landed next to them, and I landed out of sight of the tanks on the le right hand side of the field, and just took the planes out from there. The oh, uh, Valk actually came to eliminate me because uh, I knocked out the plane. Are you with thermally active? That looks fucking sick. Like it's red. What? God, it's cool. Look, look at me right now with uh, normal sight. All right. Uh, no night vision even. Yeah. Love how it looks. It's red, red goggles. Huh, I guess the red goggles don't work for your helmet, maybe? That's odd. Oh, there we go. Yeah, okay, I see it with Witterman. I see it with Witterman. Up, oh, Chase disconnected. <laughs> oh, fucking hell. No, I had a very limited uh, field of view with Fermos active uh, while I was in the unconscious in the gunner seat, so I didn't see the tanks arrive. So, were we going past them? Yeah, we were getting shot at as we were taking out the aircraft. Uh, so, if you look at the map, I landed a little bit north of the drop point, uh, like right here. I'm marking. It, I'm showing you on the map, like right around there. Yep. I saw the val. I saw the plane going overhead over this way. Took. A sh I like watched it go overhead. Turned this way. Shot it once. Saw the rocket miss. Shot it a second time. That hit it. The Valk came overhead like a fucking predator. Um, shot it at once with rockets. Couldn't reload in time, so I just pulled out the hell gun, and I guess one lucky shot hit the cockpit. Nice, or something. Man. Like, it just dropped out of the sky like a rock. Uh, <laughs> you, you hit the engines and they exploded. Oh, seriously? Uh, Fucking hell. You got like 15 shots on target, and I was all it took. God damn. Yeah. These things have stupid fast I was taking multi last fire from it. I was taking, I think, heavy bolter fire from one of the Lehman Russes that could see me through the trees. I did not give two fucks about either of those and just decided, fuck the Valk. I'm going down one way or another. You're coming down with me. <laughs> all right. So, official debrief. I'm going to start with the south because that's a lot easier to cover. Yeah, good idea. <laughs> all right. So, uh, you guys did really, really well. You guys took a long time uh, doing reconnaissance, marking targets, and because of that, you guys succeeded like extraordinarily well uh other than the range issue on the detonator where you guys had to get closer before the explosives went off on the uh first area you guys basically flawlessly did that uh the only issue is of course when you guys tried to sneak up on the avenger <laughs> well the AI's dumb but they're not brain dead yeah so, you did spot yeah. him because you were literally right next to him and, uh... taking it out of the launcher was super satisfying though <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I uh, went a little bit of a shit show for a while, but you guys managed to exfil. Romulus didn't die, Espiaggi only died once, so that was pretty worth good. Yeah. Uh, north. North had some problems, I know that. <laughs> I didn't mark anything down on map, but... So first but... of all, you guys did as much recon as you could for where you were. Um, I might have wanted to go on to the... Like a... Issues coming from northwest to southeast. Yeah, that area has a lot of tree cover. It's good for approach, not good for recon. Yeah, so uh, the, starting with your issues in the bomb. northwest. Uh, you guys managed to sneak by and plant charges on the planes just fine. Uh, but either you didn't notice or ignored the Valkyries. Uh, I was yeah. going to circle back around to deal with the other side. Where were the Valkyries? Are they on the top left? Uh, they were, yeah, top left. Yeah, I saw a large number of infantry heading that way and realized that there was a gap on the right-hand side of the field in that moment and decided, okay, we could try to go for the Valkyries where there's a lot of infantry cover, or we could head to the other side where there's a gap in the patrols and start planting bombs there, then circle back around later on. Yeah, uh, and you know, if you guys had gone completely undetected, that could have worked, but uh, you didn't. Yeah, I probably really should have ordered Chase to drop the fucking brass knuckles and take another stubber. 
don't see the brass knuckles weren't the problem. Yeah. It was just, uh, you, well, okay. They were partially the problem. If you guys had gone in with that pilot and guard, and, uh, yeah, if you'd had a pistol too, you probably could have sink killed him. Yeah. That's connecting nice. Yeah, he, uh, crashed. Ah, uh, okay. Uh, let's see. So you guys got those first two hangers fine, and then you got another two plus the plane in the middle. Yeah, that was a surprise. That guy nearly spotted us, came at us with the flashlight. I popped his head with a pistol shot. Yeah. Uh, the AI have, like, an alert behavior where they're like, oh, I think there's something there before combat. Mm -hmm. And uh, he went on that. Yeah, before he got too close, I realized he was going to spot us because he was approaching and just took a risk with a pistol shot. Yeah. All right, so anyways, you guys hit that third hangar. You guys had just been killing pilots up until then. Um, yeah, because there was one in every hangar, and, and there was just no way. Guard. Yeah. And because of that actual gunshot went off, the AI were like, oh, shit, there's people here. Yeah, that was the point where it was just like, well, fuck. I probably should have brought... Romulus is a really good eye. He spotted 99% of everything. Over here, Jace. Um, Jace, behind you. Jay, see. What the hell? So, also let something me you could have done her. is if you just placed torches outside the hangers, it would have brought the hangar down. And that would have oh, uh, yeah. I didn't want to trust that. Um, yeah, but I'll keep bad. that in mind for next time. From experience, it does work. Yeah, I didn't want to trust that because I wasn't sure which hangers had uh, a vehicle in them. Uh, cause uh, I knew that I saw like some of them moving around the vehicles phase. Yeah. Every single hangar had at least one vehicle in it. Okay. Uh, let's see. Moving on. So past that point, that's when Romulus and Espion showed up. Uh, holy shit. Your guys' distraction worked really goddamn well. <laughs> yeah. Thank you for that. You gave us enough time to get to the detonators and that gave us enough time to detonate everything. It reminded yeah. me of... Uh, one of the first missions in the Apex campaign, um, <laughs> where you get a machine gun on a prowler, a uh, prowler of a machine gun. The first time I tried it, I actually took out every single AI at the objective when another pl random player was um, driving it. I just uh, randomly machine gun every single one of them in uh, blinding, blind rage fire. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you know what? You might have been able to do that if it hadn't been for the Shikra. Yeah. <sighs> yeah. Uh, so yeah, you guys managed to draw the fire of the Shikra, of the one Chimera, and of, like, almost every squad. So yeah. There was a Chimera. There was a Chimera, yeah. I think that was what knocked you out. Chimera. Chimera. Yeah. Uh, Chimera. Oh, okay. You guys doing that gave us enough time to slip from behind the hangers into the hangar, grab our debt packs, and, uh, set up the next set of charges and everything. Why do we need an engineer, okay. by the way? Uh, you, you could have repaired your vehicles. Ah, right, I forgot it. So. Yeah, not that that mattered uh, at the end. <laughs> yeah. What, was there, like, full uh, repair at the station, at uh, any place? Uh, or... there should have been a repair kit inside the vehicle. Okay, no, I mean, I have a repair kit toolkit on me, but, like, I was wondering... Sorry, sorry never mind, I was wondering about uh, permissions, like, if we could only repair mm. an airbase or something. No, 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 no. Um, let's see. So, original plan for extract was literally just going to be you guys driving out of there. Yeah, that makes sense, but... Uh, uh, obviously, that didn't quite happen. Yeah. He got hit by a hell strike. <laughs> and hell strikes are very mean, and somehow she survived, I survived. still kind of I survived, about. too. I, yeah, but like, that was impressive. Yeah, Something. you and Ron must both survive, technically, but, you know. Yeah. It's a technical. I'm in a vegetative state. Yeah. <laughs> you two both so, still died in the Vic, so I count it as having killed you. Yeah. If Chase so, took me out of the vehicle w while I was in it, after it was hit okay. by a health strike, he could have patched first, me to health. Uh, I first, want to note uh, that Chase, by the time he was finished healing himself, both of you guys had died. Yeah. Ah, uh, never mind. He, he, you, he, he would have probably blacked, blacked out and it yeah, wouldn't have done anything. Thank you, Witterman. Also, yeah. I learned that North Team's biggest weakness is two people in one room. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah, Chase, I'm gonna be real. If you had taken a stub pistol too, that probably wouldn't have been a problem. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But I still managed to get like three people with it, so I don't really I, care. I anymore. never actually used the Gehel gun. Uh, actually, even when uh, it was just allowed, even when Romulus was being assaulted by three men with uh, uh, sword and shield, I still used the stubber, and it actually turned out pretty well. Even though we were in active combat, uh, our position 
Uh, AI, the AI didn't know our position even, even after we fought a different squad. I guess the, the AI squads AIs didn't share don't share information for each other. They communicate between squads very well. They don't, no. Inter-squad, they, they communicate wonderfully, but between squads, not that well. Yeah. Right. Which is part of why we were able to uh, take out two individuals with uh, chainswords when we got spotted. Uh, once when we were setting a bomb on the plane that was out in the open, uh, I called the chase because he was in the middle of planting the bomb and this guy was coming up with a chainsword and a shield, popped a couple shots at him, stunned him long enough for Chase to uh, get out of the Ace Interact menu and take care of that. And then the other guy, yeah, like that guy right there. Yeah, like this guy here. Exactly. Just before the mission complete screen. You did. I was the only one that stuck around. Yeah, I stuck around and I got it. Yep. No, you gotta be kidding me. Yep, you did. Uh, God damn it. Yeah. I, I'll i definitely. I streamed this whole thing. I'm gonna highlight the uh, moment where I took down that plane with the rocket and then took on the Valk <laughs> Nice. Because I need to, you guys need to see this from my perspective, because holy fucking shit. <laughs> that thing. Honestly, I, I just want to see your whole perspective, because I was jumping back and forth between those. A and lot of it was like us in the grass, I admit, but I, I am definitely going to turn this one, I think, into a full video, because holy shit, that was amazingly fun, honestly. <laughs> yep. Okay, Callus, can you please tell me one thing? Yeah. Did you hear Witterman? No, I didn't hear Witterman at all. <laughs> you have no proof, Chase. <laughs> <laughs> you <prove> nothing. <laughs> this is the fucking, uh, like, the corn berserker hugging the guardsmen, just, they'll never believe you. <laughs> <laughs> I swear. I, I was in panicking disguise. to Callus. Yeah, I was telling him, like, keep calm. It's like, you're gonna get uh, spotted because you're making a lot of noise from this. <laughs> like... <laughs> I do not fear you. He said you should. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. But, yeah, that was a blast. I honestly do love ops like this. I love commando work like this. This is so much fun. Um, God damn it. Say, I'm going to rerun this same operation, exact same, maybe more squads placed down in about uh -huh. a month as a fun op because I want to do this with more people. Oh, absolutely. I, I might be on uh... for at least one more person to be there with the North team. Yeah. The fact that we managed to take out all the vehicles when we technically had an undermanned squad is impressive. <laughs> I didn't think my last man, like give me the rockets, all the rockets <laughs> at the end would work. <laughs> I don't know if you were watching in the Zeus when I did that. <laughs> I don't think I was. You probably thought I wasn't going to do anything, knowing because I'm one guy with a Agatran launcher against two airplanes and a bunch of Lehman Russes. There was no way I should have rightfully got out of there. <laughs> <laughs> oh fucking hell! <laughs> yeah, uh, I'm going to start doing spec ops fun ops quite a bit because I used to run them all the time back when I was on the 700th, and I just haven't over here, but it seems that people enjoy them, so I'll keep doing them. They're definitely fun. They're definitely a lot of fun. Oh, man. 
I'm glad I got to put the. Thing. I'm glad I got to put the hell gun to fucking use. That was amazing. <laughs> the hell gun is literally an anti everything except armor. Apparently anti Valk as well. That's <laughs> that one Valkyrie found out the hard way. <laughs> No, no, Valkyrie's part of anti-everything. <laughs> I, I have shot down fast movers with that thing. Oh, fuck. I need to get better think, at it then. Yeah, I, I think Kedis also managed to shoot down one uh, with the fast jets. I, I didn't do it with the the uh, hell gun. I did that with two rockets. No, 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 no. The one that was starting from the hangar where you were shooting. Oh, yeah, that's right. I did take that one out. I took that one out with the hell gun burst. Yeah. That, that's what caused it to crash into another vehicle, I think. Yeah, it's what cost hit one of the Valkyries. God damn it. <laughs> what? How many plane kills is that that are manned now? Is that like four? <laughs> Let's see, you personally, including your explosives, probably killed seven planes. God damn. <laughs> oh. oh, Kallus, please tell me that you have our um, distraction on camera. Uh, somewhat. I like every so often you guys would go past the camera at fucking high speed. <laughs> <laughs> so I think I do have a couple moments of that on camera. Um, <laughs> God damn, I I really need to like grab this whole thing and convert it into a video. Oh man, I need to cut out probably some of the stuff where we're crawling through the through the grass, but. That went better than I honestly thought it would. I was a little worried when I put you guys on south because I knew there was a lot of stuff that could go wrong and I'd have no way to control that. But you guys took out the Vox engineer and that gave us so much time. I am, yeah. I'm frankly honored at the fact that you chose me to go to North team. I, I honestly I'm thought so like North side had the most that could go wrong and you have medical perms. Um... <laughs> Like not to not to down you or anything here. You you did good. You did amazingly, um, for what you had. But if somebody got hit and we needed blood, you're the only person that could give it. Unfortunately, you got domed the second we got spotted. <laughs> yeah. Oh. The, my my dream for this operation at Summer Run it is that we get twelve people so we can have three different teams. Oh, that'd be good. Two to the north, one to the south. I would love that, honestly. I first time being squad lead went pretty well, <laughs> things considered. <laughs> yeah, if I run this again, you're guaranteed at least a team lead. Oh fucking hell! <laughs> I'm definitely looking forward to that. <laughs> I I will vouch for them. They good. Oh jeez. Good squad lead. Conscript Kalis became squad lead. Gets mission done. <laughs> <laughs> Why the hell are you not a trooper at this point? I I mean, I was alone behind enemy lines in the first operation with Panda and nothing but a Chimera and operated as a two-man tank team against, like, a full squad of heretics there. Uh, admittedly, the heretic squad ambushed us, but uh, somehow I only took the hit. <laughs> Legitimately, I posted that, I think I posted that in Glamour Shots of, like, what happened and how my entire body was yellow. And I'm ordering Panda, like, okay, I need patching up. There's a guy going across the street. Stop patching me up. Shoot him down. Okay, back onto me. <laughs> Like, oh, God. God damn it. I, I have yeah, so much, like, good. evidence of just doing uh, I'm, some I'm good shit. God damn it. I'm probably going to end the stream yeah, here. Really, I really yeah. enjoyed it. Oh.